love this time of year. We are cooking in the kitchen with John Rivers from Four Rivers Smokehouse and The Coop. And John, love Christmas time, don't you? Oh my gosh. I have a countdown. I have an app on my phone. Very good. I can, I can start it the day after Christmas. It tells me exactly how long until Christmas. No morning. way. I do. Well, it was so, so much fun because before we went on the air, John's got a little phone in his pocket. He's got Christmas <laughs> music playing while we're kind of getting ready to see you all. So that's so neat. It is my favorite holiday. I do love Mine Christmas. Too. All right. So what does Christmas morning look like at the John Rivers household? Because we're going to do Christmas morning. We try to have everything done in advance so we can just relax. So yes. A big deal for me, especially with two kids growing up. Mm -hmm. and you're all over the place and you're different parents and different relatives. I know. You know we put a rule down a few years ago. Like, Christmas morning is at our house with our family and okay. our kids. Okay, just and the four of you. Just the four of us. Okay. And then, you know, we set at noon. Anybody can come over that they oh, want I to. Love and that. we call it the invasion. Yeah. And that's when it begins. <laughs> and they do and come. And they descend. Yeah, and it's wonderful. Is it beautiful. friends and family who come or just it's family? It's family during the day and that night. We always get together with friends that's as well. That's nice. And, Good. Yeah, and we love it. But, you know, one of our old traditions, because, I, you know, I like to have breakfast ready for everybody, but I don't want to be rushing that morning. Yes. It's so nice to sit by the fire, right. have coffee, and just take our time. So we do things in advance. And this is a breakfast casserole, mm -hmm. and we've been doing this, wow, for uh, as long as my son has been born, almost 21 years nice. now. Nice. And it's so nice about this. You can cook it the evening before, mm -hmm. assemble it, okay. and then that morning all you have to do is warm Heat it, it. And yeah. put it in, and right. cook it, and love that. it's ready to go. I love that. See, our Christmas morning, for some reason, Santa would always bring Whoppers. <laughs> you know what those are? The little candies okay, in my dog. No, 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 not the burger. The little chocolate candies, and that would be our breakfast. We would all eat whatever Santa really? Claus brought. I know it's bad, right? So whatever Santa <laughs> Claus brought in the stockings, that would be our bre breakfast. So I'm so excited to know that there's an, an, another alternative, <laughs> that maybe I can do this. All why, right. why give up on the Whoppers? Well, we'll have so those too. <laughs> we can do those as well. Okay, so the way that you put this together is you start with a real crusty loaf of bread. And mm -hmm. This is an Italian loaf. We just simply got this at Publix. Yes. They do a great job there in their bakery. And Barbara's going to cut those into cubes, and she's going to put them right into the casserole dish. Okay. okay. Now, while she's doing that, I'm going to go ahead and put together my egg mixture, all right, which we're going to combine with some uh, sausage that we've already uh, pan fried and put together. You can use any one that you like here. This one is not a spicy one. Okay. Do <laughs> you, know? you drain your sausage? The, I do. The, okay. Because it looks really dry. Yes. yes. And that's good. You, you, otherwise, you think about it, when you're baking it, all that grease is just going to rise and yeah. puddle up to the yeah. top. And, yeah. You, know, you don't want that. So. Are we putting this whole loaf of bread in here? A well, whole loaf? You know, go ahead and make a, you know, you can cover, a lot. The, cover the bottom. Okay. That's the important part about okay. it. You don't, certainly don't need that whole thing. So we're going to start with eight eggs and we're going to beat those really well. Now, to the eggs, I'm going to add some salt, okay, uh -huh. a little bit of pepper. So okay. this casserole is going to feed how many people? Just your four, eight eggs, four oh, people? Oh, goodness. Uh, this, no, this this will last a long time. It's, oh, you know, okay. Yeah, because it's, you got so many other things that are in it. That's true. You know, That's you true. Cut it up. And, the bread. This will serve probably a good eight people, six oh, to eight wow. people. Just but you don't like those people there. to come over, though, right? <laughs> You're not letting them come in until noon, John. Come on, John. come on now. <laughs> uh, put a little bit of dry mustard in, you know, to give it a little bit of flavor. I was going to say, what does mustard do? Uh, it just gives it a little bit of depth and flavor okay. to it. You, it's really, it never, it doesn't take over your palate, but mm -hmm. it's, it's subtle in okay. the background. Okay. And put a little bit of hot sauce in there. You kind of remember how we did the, uh, the scrambled eggs a little yes. while ago? Yes. You kind of do all this before you put it in. Okay. You ever do jalapenos? Oh, you, you know, that's the beautiful thing about breakfast. I know casserole. you like hot stuff like that. I love that, it. Right? You can put anything that you want to. Okay. You know, in here. Okay. You know, I've seen them with, um, I pulled up some this week with some uh, beautiful ham and mm. rare cheese mm -hmm. and, you know, tomatoes. And, you know, okay. I, I know Courtney, uh, her dad yes. makes one that yes. uh, I know you guys have done. Oh, it's delicious. Oh, it looks wonderful. Yes. It I smells would love to so do that. good. And it makes your house smell so good on Christmas morning, oh, yes. right? Absolutely. Whoppers don't smell. <laughs> <laughs> it just tastes good. Okay. <laughs> I've never Sorry. heard. I'm not. A, that is the first time I've ever heard of that Christmas tradition. Oh, I, have to say. I know. It's a sad one, right? <laughs> That's funny. Though. I know. Okay, so you're okay. gonna put that in here. Yeah. Let's go ahead and we're gonna put that on top. Okay. We're gonna put our sausage in now. This is. Uh, we go, went ahead and, and we greased this. Yes. So that it comes out nicely for mm -hmm. us, and you know, just evenly put your sausage mm -hmm. right above it. Nice. Okay. okay. And I love that you can do this ahead of time. That's what's really exciting to me. Oh, yes. You know, I think the less pressure Christmas morning, yes. you know, really the better for yes, everybody. Yes, absolutely. Right, I'm going to go ahead and cover that with cheese. Mm -hmm. So okay. is the um, 
Christmas music is playing in the background and your yes. kids are, are they opening presents? Are they getting their stock? Do you still do stocking? Oh, I mean, goodness, does yes. Santa, not you, obviously. Does Santa bring stockings still? Absolutely. Okay. He does stocking. You, you know, have we, we college age up. children yeah, now. We're at college, so we don't start early anymore. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that went out a long time That's ago. That's right. So That's we just right. let them take their time. Okay. And um, Whenever you know, they get up. I like to get up early mm -hmm. and light a fire. Oh, nice. And I'll get this in. Light and, a fire and crank up the air conditioning, yeah, yeah, right? And, okay, so let me ask you a question. When you're gift opening, yes. does everyone open at the same time? Oh, no. Or do you rotate? No, one at a time. Two. One, one at a time. time. Yes. Okay, second question. Are all of your, of your gifts from Santa, are they wrapped or unwrapped? Oh, um, Santa doesn't have time to wrap his presents. Oh, oh yeah. okay. Do you, does Santa wrap your presents? Santa wraps our presents. <gasps> all Santa, these Santa doesn't wrap Monica's presents, because no. Monica's Santa never wrapped presents growing up. But my Santa always did. Interesting. Because it's a surprise. I'm all about the surprise. Yeah. You know, What's the surprise the anyway when you walk out and you see the bicycle there? How do you wrap a bicycle? <laughs> I mean, we might, Santa might put a bow on a bicycle. Right, right, but, right. Yeah. I'll give that. Okay, okay, but like little boxes and stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, I that's like That's interesting. No, Santa never did wrap our presents. Interesting. Yeah. Every, it's so funny. You know, that's what happens when your families come together. Yeah. You have different traditions. Different traditions. Yeah. Yep, and you got to respect them and you blend. Uh -huh. And you uh -huh. know, isn't that about marriage? So it's compromise. Absolutely, it's, you know, it's a lot of give and, and take, and mostly um, give. Yes, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. And if we don't do that, then you've been married how many years? Oh, 25. This 25. Year. I'm 44. Wow. Not years old. I've been married for 44 <laughs> oh, years, right? Wow. So yeah. Congratulations. Yeah, I know. Okay. I, th I deserve it. <laughs> All right, so he this actually is deserves go it. In the oven. Is this going to be hot? Only about 30 yep, minutes. That's going to be yeah. hot. It's a little warm. Okay. You got it? I got it. Okay. Okay. We'll put this guy in there. Take that guy and out. And so we didn't talk about the cheese. You had two kinds of cheese in there. Yes. Cheddar and, and again, you know, whatever so you want. much liberty. Okay. I use cheddar and mozzarella today. Okay. Mozzarella gives it a nice stringy mm -hmm. taste to it. Yeah. Okay. And, um, ow. I've done these. <laughs> I told you that was hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's so rare on these that they're actually hot. <laughs> this is hot. Right. <laughs> and, um. <laughs> <laughs> You yeah, can tell uh, we never rehearse these things, John. We're just like natural, normal people. This yeah. is the way it is. And uh, I've, I like them too. I've used chorizo in it. I've made like a Mexican one. Yes. Which I'm yes. A, really a big fan of I that. I know. You like your peppers and you like things hot and oh, spicy. Yes. And, and I'll put a little hot sauce on top, but I won't right now. Okay. I'll let you uh, taste this. Okay. And it's so nice and, and you know, Thank easy you. to eat. It's yes. It's clean and it's done. It and looks wonderful. And this sits forever. And it's nice to enjoy throughout the day. Well, I'm sorry you're not joining me. It's You're okay right. if you I don't want to. to. No, All right. no, no. I would love. This is one of my favorite items, actually. Bon this appetit. Bon. I know. I hate for you not to try your. Own. You never trust a chef who doesn't try his That's own food. Right. I've learned that through the years. You know, people ask me, "What's your? What's the most important?" Um, Cheers. Thing in your kitchen? Yeah. It's your tasting spoon. The <laughs> That's it exactly is. right. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's good, Barbara. Have I told you before I don't like eggs? No, really? I love this. You like that? Mm -hmm. oh, great. It disguises the egg taste because of the sausage and what all the cheeses. And I could do this on Christmas morning. Great. And see how right. easy it was to do? New tradition at the Beck household. Thank you so much, John You're Rivers. You're very welcome. Four River Smokehouse and the Coop recipe will be on our website and Facebook. So Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Hope you have a great time with your families.